Hey, what's going on everybody? It's me here for another video. And in this one, I'm really excited because I just got a whole bunch of parts of the Mustang. All right, as you can see, we got the Mustang here, got the S2000 over there. And then right over here, we have a giant box from Mishimoto. So here in this box, not only do I have an aluminum radiator, I also have a racing thermostat. And I really needed to get that because not only am I gonna take this thing drifting, but I'm not even exaggerating when I say every single part of the cooling system on this car just went completely out on me. All right, so to start off, I literally just got done putting this car back together because there's a little coolant crossover tube under the intake manifold that was cracked completely in half because I was wondering why my car was just straight pissing coolant. Well, there it goes. So I just got that back together. Another thing too is my water pump, the pulley and like the whole like housing was cracked and it was pissing out fluid from there because I was losing coolant like immediately. So I was like, what the hell's going on? So I just got done putting a new water pump and serpentine belt in. With that being said too, still overheating. So I figured, okay, I at least need a thermostat too. And when I pressure tested the radiator, I think it's right over here. I don't know if you can see that, but I do have a crack in the radiator. So yeah, that being said, when I say everything went wrong with the cooling system, everything went wrong. But that's okay because we're going to go ahead and throw all those new parts in, get this thing ready to go for some track days. But real quick, let me give you some updates on all my other cars. So the S2000 is here in the new garage, still looking just as beautiful. The only thing that sucks with this car right now is I'm having some clutch issues. I knew this was coming with the car when I got it. The clutch was kind of slipping, but now it's pretty much on its way out. That's okay because my plans in the future is to boost this thing. So that being said, it's about time to go ahead and upgrade the clutch, the braided line, everything like that. So I'm ready actually, and I'm really excited to see where this goes. And then coming out here to my lifted CRV, this car just did great. I took it off-roading last weekend. The only thing that sucks now is that the valve stems are going, or I'm sorry, valve seals are going out. So it is smoking like crazy, but I'm about to go ahead and take it to the shop. So that being said, I don't know how, but somehow every single one of my cars has some sort of issue. So I need to get this Mustang ready to go so I can take my CRV to the shop and start saving my 2000 clutch. But that's okay because we're going to get this thing ready to go right now. So I've already got the old radiator almost all the way out, but I just gotta say, I'm so glad I upgraded. Look how tiny the factory radiator in this thing is. Like that is hilariously small. This other one's gonna be huge. Alrighty, it's time for the new radiator to go in and... Oh yeah, that's way better. Well, I bet some of y'all are wondering, hey, why do you have two Mishimoto radiators? Well, after I got this one out, I was going to throw that one in they sent me the wrong damn radiator. So that was for a 88 Mustang. And this is hopefully the right one. So I'm gonna open this one up and see if they gave me the right one. Whew. Alrighty y'all, I got it in and I'm pretty happy because it is, like I said, other than the stock one, it is huge. All I gotta do now is add the coolant, bleed the system, and we're good to go. All right, as you can see, cooling system is bled, Mishimoto radiator in, and I'm so excited because this thing is ready to rip. Guys, so that's where I'm gonna go ahead and end today's video. I do have more parts coming for the Mustang, and I also think we're gonna to go to our first drift event soon, so I'm pretty excited for that. So again, stick around for the Mustang, stick around for off-road content, drifting, I got it all, so go ahead and stick around, I appreciate y'all.